Welcome back to the channel everyone, Triple M here. In today's video, we're talking about Android TV. And for every Nvidia Shield user, this is gonna be a great addition for you. So with this addition, getting over 800 live channels. This has a classic cable TV interface. A lot of different tabs, a lot of different movies, TV shows. This is gonna be added to your Android TV and this is 100% free. So this video is gonna run to the details, what this is, how this is implemented, and curious if you have an Android TV device, what do you think about this new addition that gives you over 800 live channels? Without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into it. All right, so of course, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, smash the notification bell. Make sure you hit all on notification. That way you will be notified when new videos are released. So a couple months ago, we saw that Google TV rolled out a live TV section with new additions, new channels, really good look, fluid user interface, and just well put together, well implemented in my opinion. So the rumors was, of course, that this is gonna make its way over to the Android TV devices. And when we talk about Android TV, a lot of Nvidia Shield users that's subscribe to the channel that's been waiting for just something to spice up the Nvidia Shield while we wait for the new um, Nvidia Shield to be released. So Google roll this over to the Nvidia Shield and what this is is going to be in the live tab area for your Nvidia Shield TV. This is going to include over 800 channels. These are going to be free channels built in, no configuration required, but there's some things you can do to customize it. And we'll jump into that here in a little bit. So, so what services are included in this? So this is gonna add Google TV channels. You can see right there we have 77, but also this is gonna tap into Haystack News, it's gonna tap into Pluto TV, it's gonna tap into Tubi TV as well as Plex. Put everything all together and of course, we know the magic number is over 800. So let's just go over it real quick. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, first of all, this should be on your video shield. You shouldn't have to do much to get this configured. However, if you don't have this new look live tab on your video shield TV, what you wanna do is just check, make sure your video shield TV is up to date. To do that, you're gonna go to your settings, all right, so I know that I checked the update area right here. However, if you don't have that as part of your quick settings, you're gonna go all the way down to device preferences. You're gonna go to about. All right, right there, it's gonna have a system upgrade option. Click on that. All right, so you can see where mine is set for auto update. You might have that turn on and off, completely up to you. We can see mine um, do have a, a date right there, but I'm just gonna go ahead and check the upgrade right here. All right, all right, so completely up to date. You can see my version as of July 31st, 2023. Nvidia Shield version 9.1.1 and the build number is 33.2.0.157. So that's my current version. And as you can see, I have the new look tab. All right, so we're gonna go back home. And of course, we're talking about the live tab here on the Nvidia Shield TV. So it's right sandwiched between Discover and the Home tab up top. So all you gotta do is go over to it. Uh, you do wanna make sure that you have Pluto TV installed. You do wanna have Tubi, of course. You wanna have Haystack and um, the rest should be uh, automatic. So get those apps installed. And now all we gotta do is enjoy watching content, guys. So let's go through it a little bit. With over 800 channels, I'm gonna show you how to customize it just to make it a little bit more manageable. So up top, you can see some of the trending movie shows are on the first tab. So you can see some what's going on right there. Uh, I'm not going to go through all of them, but just a ton of content. These are all live, by the way. Scroll down, you can see they do have a dedicated Google TV area. So if you click on that, this is all on the Google TV channel. And you can see there's 77 channels. So we have NBC News, Sky News. We have some more NBC, NBC Chicago, LA. Scroll down, you have Cheddar News. You also have Family Feud, Hell's Kitchen, action, movies, documentaries. All right, just a ton of content again. And remember, this is just one dedicated area. Further down, what they did further down, they didn't just put a tab for um, Tubi or a tab for your Pluto TV. Instead, what they did is just put everything else in a separate category. So this is gonna be a mix of all of those streaming platforms that we just talked about. So popular, for instance, uh, when I scroll over, you can see that this one is from Google TV. The next one is from Tubi, Pluto TV, Tubi again. 
and so on and so forth. So you kind of get the picture. Everything is mixed in and they just put it, uh, do a good job in my opinion, just putting everything into one category. So popular is going to have 29 channels. We have movies. That's going to include 66. So let's go through them. XXX or triple X with Vin Diesel. You see that's from Pluto. We have uh, Mission Impossible 2. All right. More Pluto. We have some comedy. You can see a guy thing right there. We have horror, wolves. So again, ton of channels. And just in the movies area, we're going to have 66 channels. All right. So new and opinion. We have 41 channels there. We have crime. We have hit TV, classic TV shows. So you can see they have Andy Griffith. Uh, we have Gunsmoke, I Love Lucy, 21 Jump Street, Perry Mason, just some of the old goodies. Of course, if you grew up watching some of these shows, uh, this is going to be an area that you live. Beverly Hillbillies as well. Let's go back over. We have Reality, Storage Wars, Bar Rescue, all of the reality, I'm using air quotes, reality shows that's out there. Um, the Mass Singer, Fear Factor. Uh, we also have Top Gear UK. We have Crash biker lifestyle again ton of content below that we have sports channels so we have nfl channel cbs hq we have mlb bn extra football sports all right so i'm really digging this so far just how everything's built um make you feel like you you're actually watching a premium subscription or premium cable tv subscription completely free it is going to be ad driven of course but again completely free we have game shows we have comedy shows entertainment we have 71 channels there we have home and design food nature and travel which is where i'm going to live so you have bbc earth we have nature love nature paradise beach uh, sunday safari live sunset which i've never heard of but might want to check it out rock and park huge moves so again just just a little bit of everything for someone or a little bit of something for everyone uh, we have lifestyle channel daytime tv judge judy's there dr phil divorce court game and anime new to google tv so you can see they have 13 channels there they have a dedicated kick session and let's just kind of see how far out so you can see the current time all right so that's 8 p.m 8 30 9 30 10 p.m so it goes all the way to 10 30 so a little bit over two and a half hours worth of TV guide there. We have music channels. All right. Hit list. All about the 90s. Nothing but the 90s. Remember the 80s. We have 102 Spanish channels. And we have 47 international channels. Euro News. Euro News. Globy. <laughs> um, a lot of that I haven't heard of, of course. And local channels. I have 148 local channels. So... A lot of these are going to be my news channels. You have Fox 5. We have local news, Fox 23. So, again, remember a lot of these channels, these local channels, especially on NFL Sundays, these are going to have live football. So, pretty cool to have. All right. So, we have so many channels. And this might be a little bit overwhelming. So, how do I customize this? How do I organize this to make it um, kind of work for what I'm trying to do? So, cool thing about this is that you can always add things to your favorite so for instance if i wanted to add a uh, pluto spotlight i go over to right there where it says favorite or you see the star next to it click on that and if you look right above the built-in area you can see that favorite is now listed up there so let's add a couple more and see how that looks all right so let's go to let's go to hit tv shows let's go csi miami we'll add that all right Beverly Hills. Let's just add that. Let's go back over. We're going to add uh, entertain. Let's add some nature. So BBC Earth. All right. We'll add that as well. And let's just add a couple daytime. All right. Dr. Phil and Judd Judy. All right. So now if I go all the way up top, you can see favorites. I have seven channels there. So now um, this becomes uh, my focal point. So once I launch the live area, this is going to be the first channels that's listed. Just makes it a lot easier to get to. So you can see these right here are all going to be my favorite. So that gives you at least the option to kind of customize what you see, especially like I said, if you're overwhelmed, over 800 channels, you don't want to always have to search for what you want. So this gives you some options to kind of 
put your favorite channels towards the top, thus making them easier to get to. So I'm going to cut this video right here, run a little bit longer than I, I thought it would or I wanted it to. But so far, I'm really loving this, just how everything's put together. Just the option to really um, customize this. I feel like the look gives you a premium feel. Just everything about it I like. Not a lot of setup, in my opinion. You do have options to customize what you're seeing. Gives me that premium cable feel that I'm paying $67 for. Only difference is that this is completely free. Of course, if you're new to the channel, hit that subscribe button, smash the notification bell. Thank you for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one.